things. Is he going to burn it all up on getting these people confirmed? Or is he going to use it for other things, right? You know, he's got to close the border. He's got all these things he wants to do. But you only have so much, right? You can only go to the well so many times before members keep, they start kind of shrugging, right? And so uh, I think he's going to get a lot done. I think you're going to get a lot of these members done. And, and the most consequential is, of course, in, in this instance, is whether Matt Gates becomes the attorney general or not. And so how much political capital is he going to put behind that? You know, we're going to see. Um, Van, uh, CNN is reporting that right-wing media personality and former Secret Service agent Dan Bongino, we, we, by the way, like years ago, we would have him on to talk about Secret Service issues on this show. Um, he is uh, being considered for Secret Service director. Uh, here's to some of what he said on his podcast today on how he views the new administration. It's cutesy time is over, and we led the way. And a lot of people are recognizing that, folks. Cutesy time is over. I'll say again today on Wednesday, People are policy, and it is time for us, because we are the news, to double down on the MAGA agenda. Van, you're going to have to stop being so adorable, because cutesy time is over. <laughs> <laughs> no, but seriously, in, 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 in all sincerity, there is, that does uh, reflect a, an attitude uh, of, of so many of these picks, which is it's time to really, really shake up Washington. And, um, and, the, and a lot of people think... If a lot of Trump supporters think that he went with establishment picks last time. and That was a horrible idea. He wasn't able to really drain the swamp. And now that's what they're doing. You have to believe a lot of things that are not true for this to make sense. What is the problem you're trying to solve with our intelligence services? Um, we, we get a chance to walk around here uh, and not have bombs blowing up all over the place because our intelligence services are doing a fantastic job keeping us safe. If you think that sending a wrecking ball through our intelligence services, putting people in charge whose main qualification is that they're pugilistic, like to pick fights, and like Donald Trump a lot, if they do, that's going to make America a lot safer, I, the people who are going to pay the price for this experiment are people who are going to lose their lives here and overseas. And so uh, you have to believe things that are not true. Um, our intelligence services are the best in the world. They don't need to be shaken up and burned to the ground. Uh, same with our law enforcement agencies. They don't need to be shaken up and burned to the ground. And if you do, everything that comes as a consequence of the disruption is on your hands here and abroad. 